Hello and welcome to this MRE review. This is menu two, the beef shredded in barbecue sauce. So let's open it up and see what we got. Wow. So we've got some plain tortillas, nice. A broken spork, opened a broken spork, not so nice. <laughs> the flameless ration heater hot beverage bag excellent beverage base powder orange I'm looking forward to that black beans in sauce that sounds good black bean in sauce okay I thought it was beef shredded but I guess I'll barbecue sauce black beans in barbecue sauce I'm thinking of Chinese oh no look, there's the barbecue sauce there's a condiment pack Oatmeal cookie, these are really good. <laughs> My favorite, a cheese spread with jalapenos. What a result. Oh, nice. Let's open up the condiments. Got some gum, creamer, non-dairy. Barbecue sauce, ha <laughs> coffee. I'm definitely missing one out of my last one. Latex free towelette, salt, sweetener, locale, just uh, different, I guess. Toilet tissue, it's all there. It's looking good, I'm looking forward to this. So, we'll start off by getting the oh, we've got shredded beef. Oh, okay, so we've got shredded beef and black bean in sauce. Okay, that's interesting. Hmm, shredded beef and black bean. Okay, so could be good, could be good. So shredded beef and barbecue sauce and black beans in a seasoned sauce. So as a Brit, what goes best with tortillas? I guess a bit of both. But then, what's the cheese spread with jalapenos for? Maybe that just goes in with one of them. I don't know. I guess I'll just mix it all together and we'll see what comes out, right? Um, today it's 32 degrees. I'm in the forest. I've had a long hike in and um, I kind of just want a drink, not a hot drink. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mix up this, um, this beverage powder. That's the first thing I'm gonna do. This one's the orange. Smells nice, smells like um, dextrose, Lucas said dextrose tablets. Let's have a look, blah, blah, blah. Okay, fill with water first, fair enough. I'm gonna go for a 12 ounce filling in the bag. So there's the, the line there for 12 ounces. Or thereabouts, it's a little bit too much. Let's pour some back. There we go, uh, lid on so we don't lose that. And the powder goes in as the wind picks up. Okay, seal it well before you shake. And I always just fold it over a couple of times as well. Just to make sure we don't get any drippage. <laughs> That looks like carrot juice. Let's try a bit. Mm, it's gonna be fun drinking it out here. That's really nice. It's like a Gatorade. Mm. Oh, that's four ounces down. <laughs> mm mm mm. That's really good. That's really good. Save some of that for a, in a bit. Like that. Good start. Good start. And I'll get the condiment packs that I'm not going to use out of the way. I'm not going to have a hot drink today. So just put them to one side. 
Awesome, let's get the hot food on, I think. So, tear the heater. We've got the fill lines again. Pop these MREs in. I'm looking forward to this one. The last one I did was the pizza, and that was pretty good. I think I gave that an 8 out of 10. <clears throat> so we'll see. See what this does. Uh, you kind of want the heater, in my opinion, you want the heater in between the, the food pouches. So we'll try and do that. I'm really hoping this is going to work, this, this flameless ration heater, because I don't have any other way of heating up the stuff. Let's give it a go. That should do it. Don't need much. You hear it? Again, I tend to give these things a little shake just to make sure the water's in there. Let's place that down. That should puff up with a bit of luck as it activates. Ooh, decisions, decisions. You know what, I'm in the forest at the moment. I'm getting eaten by bugs. Ugh. Oh, don't forget your cardboard sleeve so you can... Uh, You can pop that in there. Keeps it tight. There we go. So we've got the oatmeal cookie, we've got a barbecue sauce. Let's have a look at these tortillas. A little bit of a hiss opening there, which is good. Oh man, these are good. smell. <clears throat> it's a bit of a chemical smell to them, but nothing too bad. Awesome. So we've got that. So we've got this oatmeal cookie as well. 208 calories. Now last time I had one of these they were very good. Uh, this one's not quite in one piece. That's alright. Let's try a bit of that while we're waiting. Mm. Really nice as always. Like that. Mm. That's good. Right, so it's been a, uh, what have we been? It's been about 15 minutes or so. So let's uh, let's get it out. So look, let's see what we bought. Okay. This is the shredded beef one. We'll just dry her off. Nice and hot, this is what you need on a hot day. Oh my goodness. Dan, mate, this one's for you, buddy. Shredded beef. There's a hair in that. Oh. Not cool. There might be a bit of sinew. Mmm, <laughs> high quality MREs. Ooh, it tastes very nice. And then this one we've got the black bean. Let's get those out. I haven't really got any space otherwise. Oh, always, eh? Let's see if we can get it from the other end. 
do like a bigger hole. Oh, this smells good. Doesn't smell like black bean, but it's definitely got beans in it. The dreaded kidney bean. Still. Should be interesting. That's better than that. I think um, I've got barbecue sauce. I reckon that goes over. Oh no, fail. Oh, it's gone everywhere but where I want it. Yeah. Mm. Barbecue sauce is good. Right, let's just have a quick clean up on aisle three. Mm. Let's just try the beans. Mm. That's pretty good. You know what? Now that cheese doesn't look as good as the one I had yesterday. Let's squeeze it out. Jalapeno cheese. Squeeze cheese for the English. It's not proper cheddar or anything like that, but I reckon that'll go well in there. What do you say? Mm. Nothing wrong with that. Got some spice. Mm. That's good. That's good. All right, let's try these tortillas. <clears throat> I do like a wrap. really sweet I have to say guys the um I prefer the American MREs so far the British ones hmm I've got deep flavor spice a little bit the tortilla is really good really flowery it's really soft mm -mm -mm. More tortillas, I think. Maybe, maybe one or two extra. Look at that meat. That's good. Let's have a spoon on its own. Mm. That's good. That's real good. Nice. It's like pulled pork. Consistency. Mm. I said this on the pizza one as well. It's um, it's nice that they don't overfill you. I quite like these meals. There's enough. Mm. There's enough there, but it's not. It's not overkill. The British ones tend to be more stodgy. Mm -mm -mm. Well, marks out of 10. The tortilla and that, that's a nine. That's okay. More of a six for that. But it's nice, nice. Even the kidney beans, which I don't really like. The drink was brilliant. There is a coffee sachet in this one for a change, which I'll try later on. Yeah. Is it better than the pizza one though? 
<clears throat> the cobbler made it on the pizza one. I think the pizza one just pips it, and I think I gave the pizza one eight out of ten. So this is a this is a seven and a half. Mm. Nah, eight. I'll give it an eight as well. Just different. Mm. If you have this as the main, with a couple more tortillas and a cobbler for pudding, huh. I reckon that'd be a ten. But the clean plates and bowl says it all, doesn't it? Yum. Nice. Latex free moist towelette. My hands are really grubby because we've had to film today on an island in the middle of a lake and we had to wade over to it and I've got gunk all over me. So apologies for my grubby hands. The gum in the red packets is a um, cinnamon flavouring. Let's see, I'm pretty sure these will just be mint. Mm. Mint. Nice. 